you're gonna make us cry. Yeah. I'm about to start crying. So you can start crying. Okay. Uh, I'm getting married. I'm getting married. Times and places are all in who you share them with. And it's life. my first time hearing about Matt. I was walking around Newhart when I got the phone call from Chessie. She went on and on and on about him, how he was from Vernon, how they were in middle school jazz band together, how they were in marching band together, how he was so sweet and so nice. That was the first of many phone calls about Matt, and from what I heard over and over, I knew she had found the one. Chessie made a fantastic choice. I've been a fan of Matt since the day I met him. I never felt the need to be overprotective of Chessie with him because I always had confidence that he would treat her right, and he has. Matt, you're such a sweet, smart, caring person, and there's nobody I would rather have my best friend spend the rest of her life with. Matthew, I've been so grateful to have you as my brother and to have you to look up to. I feel like I've known Matt forever now. I mean, it's been six years when I was a junior in high school. Growing up, or always, Chessie was there to guide me and help me. You are a spectacular daughter, both highly intelligent and caring. Trust your sense of whimsy to recognize when to breathe. I remember thinking to myself, uh, after a particularly rough, you know, few we few weeks of, of her first college semester with rough commutes and things like that, she could really use a break. Um, uh, something in her life could it could change for the better, or something, some way uh, that could get better. And uh, you can probably guess that within a few months, that break was her meeting Matt Roy. <laughs> Chessie, ever since you came into Matthew's life, I felt like I finally had a sister. You and Matt are perfect for each other. I love the two of you so much. And Matt, we're so lucky to welcome you to the family, and I'm so happy to say that you're my brother. I've had the pleasure of knowing and being close friends with Matt for over 15 years at this point. He is eas easily the most thoughtful, caring, and empathetic person I know and will always go out of his way to help someone he cares about. He is a future-focused, goal-oriented person that is very inspirational to talk with and motivates me to be better. And sitting down and having a conversation with him is always enjoyable because of how great of a listener he is. I am really happy that Matt found Chessie, who values all these wonderful qualities which are mirrored in her. I found so much joy in watching how much they've grown alongside each other over the years and seeing the way they love each other is inspiring. Chessie, you mean the world to me. I can't imagine what life would be like without you by my side. You have an enormous heart and you're one of the goofiest people I know. You've helped hold me up during some pretty dark times and I know I can always rely on you. Matt, you are a man of honor and integrity who has captured my daughter's heart. You make her happy. I count so much. This is now your family too. 
And Jen and I want to make it perfectly clear they are no longer Mr. and Mrs. De Palma. We are mom and dad under any circumstance. And to this, I give Matt the highest badge of honor I can bestow. Matt, welcome. I, Matthew, take you, Francesca, to be my wife. I, Francesca, take you, Matthew, to be my husband all the days of my life. Matt and Chessie, I wish you both the best of luck going forward and hope your marriage is filled with personal growth, love, and happiness. Thank you again for all coming out to celebrate this lovely couple and cheers to a lifetime of love, happiness, and lots of mac and cheese. First time, I grant you Mr. and Mrs. Matthew Roy.